Hello everybody, how are you doing? Today I'm going to talk about one of my events when I went to Greece, so what happened. We would go out to the, they called them discotheques. The discotheque. We would go to the discotheque and we would dance and there was two. There was one called Roxy and the other one was called GTS. So we wanted to leave and we got the taxi cab and um, but when you're on the dance floor when you're in Greece or where I went in nightclub they follow you around on the dance floor as you're dancing and you can't get the fuck away from these guys they're just constantly following you so we wanted to leave so we got a taxi and then a car full of Greek guys got in a car and we were in this big fucking car chase and uh, we didn't know exactly how to get back to my aunt's house so we told the cab driver to go to the bank of Crete and he said the bank of Crete is closed well yeah it's fucking two o'clock in the morning of course it's fucking closed just fucking go past the bank of Crete and then we'll tell you where to turn next because we didn't know where in the hell we didn't have like any idea except like say like there's the fucking bank of Crete or there's the fucking place where you get a Heineken that's how we knew our way around by fucking things that we saw so we told the cab driver don't fucking let us off in front of the house so he parked like three blocks away and we were crawling around on our hands and knees to the front door. Thank God we didn't get followed. So this video is, I'm thinking about if you're a woman and you want to get married and you can't get married, <laughs> you can definitely find a boyfriend if you go to Greece. Well, because they were chasing us around like crazy. So, you know, it could happen. You know, I didn't want to get, you know, involved with anybody in a foreign country. Not that I have anything against foreign countries. You know, my father's from a foreign country. So, then another time we went down to the water, down to the beach, and there was this guy named Nikos. And he was following us everywhere. Every fucking time we turned around, he was there. So we went out in the water, and we swam all the way down to the other end. And we popped our heads up out of the water. Hello, girls. Hello, girls. How you doing today? Hello, girl. I was like, oh, my God. Are you kidding me? He followed us all the way. I mean, it was a long stretch of water. We couldn't get rid of him. He wore the same fucking white pants every day. And the same fucking white t-shirt every day. And the same white fucking shoes every day. But he had a little bit of stains on his white shoes. And let's see how old fucking closet full of white pants and white t-shirts and white fucking closet full of shoes. So, anyway. That was um, my trip to Greece. And... There was other stuff that happened, too, but, um, oh, then there was Bobby. Oh, my God. And he would just, like, come up everywhere, and he would, he would, um, he would just, like, sit right in the restaurant as we're eating, and he had this Speedo on, and everything was, like, <laughs> getting ready to fall out. I'm not going to say it, but, you know, just imagine that. You're having a nice lunch in Greece on vacation and this guy comes up in a speedo and all his stuff is getting ready to fly out and I was thinking oh my god I said look Bobby you got to get the hell out of here Bobby get the fuck out of here we're having a nice lunch and you just need to leave okay so get the hell out of here you my girls you my girls you go to discotheque tonight you my girls you go to discotheque I was like, oh, Christ, are you kidding me, Bobby? Then he was fucking kissing me. I was like, oh, my God, really? I was like, Bobby, stop it, Bobby. Then we would be at the cafe, and he would walk right by, and he would try to kiss me. I was like, Bobby, stop it, Bobby. That's enough. Oh, my God. So, anyway, if you're an American woman, 
and you feel like you need a man, you could get very lucky in Greece. They chase you like freaking animals over there. So I hope you enjoyed my video. Um, I hope you give me a thumbs up and I hope you subscribe and like. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye.